A six foot guard is usually looked at as a defensive liability in the NBA, but Davion Mitchell is the complete opposite. He was locking up guys all season and earned his way to an all NBA defensive team. Let's break down exactly how he did it. One thing to note is that he has great reaction time, but also a really strong lower body. Here he's guarding Steph Curry, and watch as soon as Steph makes a move to change direction, he uses his outside foot to stop his momentum and then pop back up to get in front. He's great at sliding his feet. Watch here how he does a great job of anticipating the drive and stepping right in front of the ball handler to cut off their path. This forces them into a counter and eventually a turnover. We're going to cover more in the future of how to guard the post as a guard, but I wanted to include this clip because he does something really important here. He's guarding Paul George who has a big size advantage on him. Now as Paul George is going up to shoot, he's not going to jump and try to contest the shot because he knows Paul George will probably just shoot over him. Instead, as he sees the ball going up for a shot, he's going to put his hands straight out and try to tip the ball as much as possible to prevent him from getting this ball cleanly to a shot pocket. There's a few subtle details to go over here. As he presses up on the ball handler, watch how as they jab towards the middle, he reacts by stepping that way and putting his hand out. That's so if they do try to drive that way, he can use his left hand to tip the ball and steal it. But this time instead, the ball handler is going to try and drive baseline where Mitchell does a good job of crowding his space and then forcing him towards the help where he has to take a tough baseline pull up. He also doesn't quit on defense. Sometimes he'll get crossed a little bit on a move and he'll still pop up and find a way to reset his feet in order to contest the shot. He's really mastered using his outside foot as a break in order to stop himself and get back in front of the ball handler after a good move. One of the biggest skills of being a great on-ball defender is being able to anticipate where a driver is going to go and then beating them to the spot. Watch here how he beats Murray to the spot and then forces him to take a more difficult turnaround shot. Watch here how he gets caught out of position on a move, and then he's going to quickly just turn his hips and sprint to get back in front of his man, which is eventually going to force a tough shot. Watch here as Trey has outside position on the drive, he's still going to find a way to get back in front and take contact to his chest to force a tough shot. Completely out of control.